So brothers, welcome to this uh, Cine Forum on the Life of Pi. Thank you for coming. Thank you to Father Rector for organizing this opportunity. This is uh, the movie Life of Pi. It's from 2012. It's based on a 2001 book by a Spanish author uh, from Salamanca, Jan Martel, who then became Canadian, right? So 2001, he wrote the book. 2012, they made it a movie. The movie earned $609 million. It was nominated in 2012 for 11 Academy Awards, in other words, 11 Oscars. So it was the most nominated movie in the year. It won four Oscars, which was the most number of Oscars for the year as well. And the most important of those was Best Director, right? So the best Oscars are always Best Movie, Best Actor, Actress, and Best Director, and it won one of those together with three other Oscars. Um, the theme of the movie, you will see enunciated very clearly within the first 15 minutes in this conversation between this gentleman and another gentleman, right? And he says, I'm going to tell you a story to make you believe in God. So that's the theme of the movie. And keep that in mind when you watch the movie, because everything's supposed to make you believe in God. And the discussion at the end is going to be, was it successful in making us believe in God? And how does the movie try to do this? And, and then there are different themes within that, right? Um, the movie's about an hour and a half, an hour 40 minutes. It's in three parts. So this is not an Arnold Schwarzenegger action-packed, uh, movie, right? It's a little on the slower side. It's more drama than action. Well, it is drama rather than action. It's in three parts. At the beginning, you have the introduction and you have a lot of dialogue between this Canadian author who comes to visit this gentleman in Montreal and they start talking. And the theme of the movie is enunciated. It is proclaimed. Those, there are a lot, there's a quite a bit of dialogue, it's very important. Be very attentive to the dialogue. There are a lot of themes announced, okay? And then the rest of the movie, the, the, the body of the movie, 90% of the movie is the story, right? He tells the story of his life to this Canadian author and we'll see the story. And then right at the end, the last five minutes of the movie is, we come back to the both of them and it's the conclusion, right? So keep that in mind. I hope you enjoy the movie and then above all the discussion at the end. So enjoy. Thank you. 